Look, it's easier now. We're going downhill. We just gotta keep walking. Uh, yeah, that's better. Hey, maybe we'll find a milkshake shop. Ah, oh, yes. A four secret milkshake factory. <laughs> keep dreaming, dude. Let's walk a little more. There will be a rest stop or something where we can buy food. I'm sure of it. Oh, remember that time? Harry Thompson wanted to beat me up. Me and Noah traded some games with Harry, but he didn't like us, so he said he was gonna get us after school. What did you do? We waited in the gym until he went home. That's it? You should have told me. I tried, but you said to get out of your room. <sighs> I'm sorry, you know. I should have listened. You did stand up for me, with Brett, for a change. Yeah, well, he had it coming. Yeah, I kind of wish you weren't so mean all the time. I'm sorry, Daniel. I'm trying. Hey, there's something ahead. Yep, must be the gas station we saw on that sign. Shit, my phone's dead. Awesome. I'm so hungry for real food right now. I hear you. We're gonna get food, water, and plus a map. So we can find the best route. All right. Hey, come on. I know last night was tough, but... Tonight will be better. I swear. Yeah. I hope. California plates. Maybe they can help us. Sean? You sure it's okay to poke around? What the? Something's under that cookie box. Sean, can we find some food? Okay. Be gentle. Fly. Be free. Not bad, Sean. Hey, you forgot something, Brady. I'm not even sure what kind of bird you are. But I'll keep this. Do they make actual money doing this? Can't believe how lost we are. Damn. Why do they let this rust out here? I know Dad would be able to fix it. Yeah. Maybe not that one, dude. He has to finish your car first. Yeah. 
I know. Look at all but this is the just many bears. too many bears. I wonder if the big one is their dad. <laughs> kind of creepy, huh? Nah, I think they're cute. We should have one at home. Dad would love it. No way we're carrying a freaking log around, dude. <sighs> okay. Right. It's cool we found this place. At least Daniel gets a little Halloween spirit. Sean? You see that sign? Warning? I'm fine. I'm too young. Um, maybe some other time. I'm on it, Hillbilly. Yeah. After the night we just had, I'll pass. Nachos and cerveza? You sound like an expert douchebag. Hey, look. They're gonna teach us Spanish. Este tipo es un idiota. Oh, shit, they're still looking for us. We can't go back. Can't let Daniel know. Not right now. had a thing for gas stations. We stopped at so many on our road trips. He says they're all kind of the same. They feel familiar. Almost like home. Same bad coffee. Same nasty toilets. Same food. But I don't feel at home at all. Sorry, just daydreaming. Okay. Let's go. Last night was so cold, I don't even want to think about ice. It sucks I can't do Halloween. There might be some leftovers in it. Fuck, is this our life now? There's nothing to do here. When do we leave? Better clean up before we look like the gutter punks downtown. Hey! Come on in. Let's wash a little. Oh, I'm coming. Stop watching me, he looks, perv. He looks like one of your drawings. Oh, shit. My face. You look older, dude. Nice. Free water for us. 
Good to go, or do you need to? Ma, it's okay. I went in the woods just before we got here. Cool. I want cocoa. Honey, this is a gas station. Wonder what they're doing here. Maybe they got some extra food. Um, hey, hi. Uh-oh, here it comes. Oh, hi there. Uh, it's a really nice weather for a picnic. Isn't it? So what are you boys doing this gorgeous day? We're camping for the weekend. But... Uh, we, my dad forgot to bring our groceries, so we had to come here. Oh no, I hope you didn't have to walk far. Where are you camping? I don't know the name of the spot. It's over there, that way. You don't know the name of your campsite? Hmm, okay. So, are you guys just visiting, or? <laughs> It's kind of out of the way here. Just passing through on our way to Vancouver to check on our new home. All the way from California. Yeah, like everybody else in Vancouver. Oh, that's cool there. We're from Seattle. That's nice. I just love the weather up here. Yeah, who loves the sun? Can't wait for all that snow. I hate the snow. Oh, that's not that bad. But I don't know about Vancouver. It's lovely, according to the books. Oh, jeez. You and your books. We'll see. Hey, happy Halloween. My brother's a zombie. Don't you have a costume? Nuh-uh. I'm 11 years old. Halloween is for kids. Oh, my brother loves it. I don't. I'm almost 12. Kids always want to be adults. If only they knew. So... How old are you? Uh, he's nine. I'm almost ten. Oh, you can talk. <laughs> yeah, he can talk. A lot. Whatever. Uh, I hate to ask, but... Uh, we forgot to get money before coming here, so... Could you spare a little food? Or something? Do you mind? We're kind of busy. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. We'd like to help, but... I thought we left Berkeley to get away from this. Ugh. I'm sorry. Uh, hey, no worries. It's cool. Didn't mean to bug you. Bye. Come on. Let's go. Daddy, I'm cold. You said we're going to get some food. Look at the chips. Dude, stop. Let's go. Hello there. Whoa, Sean. Hey. They have Choco Crisp. You promised I'd get one. Wish we could join the crew, guys. <laughs> Might on Pupper Road cred.
so cute, I hate it. See the baby bear, Daniel? Oh, that is awesome, possum. I mean, bear. So cool. Then he's all yours. We have a surplus, as you can tell. Really? Oh, thank you. Yeah. Dad would have loved this so much. Right. I'll just bust out my platinum card. It should be called Daniel's Cash Trap. Oh my god, this is Power the Bear in the ever. Backwoods. <sighs> More like power marketing. Hey, come here. Check it out. Hmm. Never heard of that team. Sean? <laughs> She's staring at you. Daniel deserves this. Sorry, dude. You'd had to drag my ass to make me come back here after all this. No tourist is gonna do this shit. Come on. I hope Halloween isn't ruined for Daniel by all this. Lila would love that. Yes, gas station food is nasty. <laughs> but I I'm like too it. nervous to drink any coffee. Do not drink that coffee. Weird to be in if you like coffee. Forest. Like another Damn. That guy looks like a freaking stalker. Like another world. Maybe not as good as dad's. Hi. But what yummy. Oh. Hey there. Well, I'm actually doing research. It's, uh, not for we you. We could live in that. Why? Like dirty but there's stuff? no way we can pay for it. It's, uh, adult I know Daniel stuff. would love to have a souvenir. Starts with an I know animal. these kind of things. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, sure you do. What's your name? Daniel would love Daniel. that thing. Hi, Daniel. I'm Brody. Wait to shit. Why we could just camp out in here. For work. Ooh. After last night... Must be a nice job. I would kill for one of these. Yeah. Well, see you. Pretty sweet. Don't Ooh, worry, Sean. we'll get Check you a out. new family a soon. Costume. I want to be around Great. Here. Daniel's gonna be all over that puppy. Daniel, 
Come check this out. What? What is it? It's a puppy. Super cute. <laughs> yeah, super cute. Is this yours? Somebody left her down the road. If I saw who did that, it'd be the last time. Aw, he must be sad. What's his name? Her. Whoever takes her gets to name her. Oh, right. Oh, can we have the puppy, please? <sighs> Let me think. I don't know. It's a pretty huge responsibility. Yeah. It would be so cool. Come on. Oh, honey. We have to have an adult take care of her. I know. I just thought we could. I'd love to. But she's right. We can't take care of a dog right now. Hey, what about that? We could use that. Six down is a short one. Perfect. Blue sky. Who sends postcards? Seriously. Who's buying all these wooden bears? Oh, we do have a sale on our famous bears. Buy one, get one free. At least she seems okay. Boring. Nice to but meet nice. You. I'm Doris. That is so, so cool. exactly Wish I could send Lila a postcard. It's a secret like a regular adventure. holiday is trip. so? Sounds intriguing. Did you make all these bears? Oh, no. I won't take I guess Daniel money. would kill for some soda. <laughs> Me too. Stop making them. Oh, Gotta no. have water to live, man. Oh, I think they're so cute. Well, good for you. Sure glad somebody does. We can live on bread for a few days if we have to. Is she laughing at us? Can't go wrong with these. Don't laugh Seven at Zomboy. Down. Silly witch. God's gas. Okay. That would be P R O P A. I know what you're thinking. What the hell is this creep looking at? Uh, no, I don't mean... I mean... It's not as weird as it seems, though. These people, they only want to live a normal life. Just... naked. I mean, if they're not harming anyone, who's to say they're wrong? Nobody. Yeah, I agree. Yes, why should we all be the same? Who says so? <laughs> Never mind. I'm getting carried away. Name's Brody. I'm kind of an online traveling journalist. Sean. What's a online traveling journalist? Just a fancy name for someone who drives around in a car, writing about people and stuff. There's a few websites that pay me for these papers since I know how to write. Nice to meet you, man. You traveling with your brother? Our dad's with us. We're going south. Good for you. The best way to learn is on the road. The earlier, the better. Well, I'd love to talk and avoid work all day, but I'm already up against the deadline. Safe travels, dudes. Thanks, man. See you around. Hope you don't mind me hogging the table. Dude. I know. Power Bear is amazing. I'm gonna put this in my room. Well, what brings you all the way out here? Mm -hmm. <sighs> We're camping. Yeah? Where? I... I can't remember the name. It's not far. Looks like you went through a mud flow. Oh, uh... We went on a big hike and fell. A lot. So where are your parents? We're with... our dad. Hmm. That makes sense. How come he's not here with you? He... went hiking. So he told us we could hang out and explore. Huh, that sounds fun. 
What trail did he go on? Uh... I'm not sure of the name. Yeah, if you say so. Wow, did something interesting happen here? Oh, that's my husband up there. He built this place 30 years ago. Yep. Who's the guy with him? Is that supposed to be someone famous? Yep, that's a famous Hollywood director or something. He made a show up here, but we don't watch TV. Nice man. Don't think he liked our coffee. Perfect. We should be able to find our way with this. Looks like you're all set to go. Is that it? Yeah. I think so. Okie dokie. Let's ring you up. And there's the damage. There you go. Thanks much. All right, here's your change. Cool. Thanks. Go on. It's actually free. Cool. Thanks. It's a real nice map. You'll find lots of great hiking trails around here. Don't worry. We'll get you a new family soon. <sighs> Never thought I'd be so excited to see a gas station. Grab it and check out this map. Yay, a fucking half eaten apple. We don't eat it. Nobody will. All right. Time to plan our next stop. If Daniel asks me if he can keep one of those birds for a pet, so help me. How can someone drive with this mess? Yep. Let's see. What do we got here? We're eating leftovers from strangers. I know, Daniel. We can't afford them. But it'll get better. I swear. Really? You got me a choco crisp? Of course I did. You deserved it. Where are you guys off to now? Uh, south, I guess. Right on. Pro tip, don't feed the bears. <laughs> See you later. Whoa, that's a big map. <sighs> yeah, hope I can read it. Washington? I don't recognize anything. Yeah, me neither. But we have to be somewhere in there. Hey, I know. We're here. There's a gas station. See? Nah, no way. We were near Mount Rainier yesterday, but it's miles away now. Let me show you where we are, okay? Yeah, okay. We slept at that trout trail thing. 
Then we walked south for a while. Hmm. We have to be somewhere southwest of Mount Rainier. We slept at that trout trail thing. Then we walked south for a while. Nope. This can't be here. Um... Definitely not there. Damn. Where can this be? All right. This is it. Are you sure? Yes, it is. It's next to the river we camped by yesterday. Here we are. Okay, so... Can we go there tonight? Are you kidding? It's way too far. You want to walk a whole week again? Aww. But it looks cool. Hold on. I'll find where we can go. Hey, kids. Looks like you're out camping. Oh, yeah. Just going over trails and stuff. Seems dangerous to be out here all alone. But maybe you're the ones who need to be watched. Huh? What do you mean? We sure just... hope you pay for all that. We don't tolerate shoplifters. Uh... Sir, we paid for this. And the map was free. Well, let's go inside. You can show us what you bought. Uh, no, thanks. We have to go. Nope. You're going inside. Don't make this worse for yourself, kid. Or I will. Uh, excuse us, sir. We were just hiking, I swear. Then let's find out if you're telling the truth. Come on. Uh, but we have to get going. Sean? Uh, it, it's okay. Look, our, our dad is waiting for us. Okay. You can call him from our phone. Now let's go. Don't touch me! Don't do it, boy! Let go! Uh, Don't touch my brother! Well, it's Hank. Hank Stamper. Listen, I caught myself a couple of fugitives you might be interested in. Oh, they ain't going anywhere. Don't you worry. Okay, fine. Thank you. What the fuck? Where am I? Oh shit, Daniel, no, 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 don't do this to me. Police will get those two straightened out. Are you sure about this, Hank? I don't know. Then they'll be off our property and won't be our problem no more. If you say so then, well, I'll let you deal with it. No, hey there, you finally awake? Sorry I had to secure you. But if you're innocent, don't act guilty. How's your stomach? I'm gonna tell the police you kidnapped me. Nice try. But I know who you are and what you did in Seattle. I saw it in the paper. Maybe I should call ICE to make sure you're a citizen. Fuck you, hillbilly. I'm American. Mm. Watch it, punk. Whatever. You're going to jail for this. Pretty sure the local police will vouch for me over a thug like you. Where's my brother? Wish I knew. Little shit took off. I'll find him. Don't worry. If you touch him... You think I'd hurt a little boy? Guess you didn't have any second thoughts about leading him out into the middle of nowhere, though. That's real safe for a little kid. If he's lucky, 
He won't end up like his criminal big brother. Just let me go. Please. You're the reason we need to build that wall. You hold tight. I'm gonna go get your brother. More light from it. Americans. Daniel must be scared shitless. I can't leave him out there. Daniel? I'm right here. Are, are you okay? I, I, I think so. That old guy chased me into the woods. I think I lost him. Is he gone? I'm really, really scared. <laughs> hey, Emmanuel. You're doing great. You totally fooled them. <sighs> Thanks to you, we have a chance of getting out of here. Yeah? Yeah. We gotta hurry, though. He called the cops on us. Think, dude. There's gotta be a way out of here. I don't even want to think of this asshole reading the same magazines as Dad. Oh, yeah. This racist shithead is a real pillar of the community, all right. I'm sorry, but you married an asshole. Can you try and open this vent? Figure something out. <sighs> so close, but yet too fucking far. Hey, you think you can open the back door? Over there. Maybe you can find a way in or something. Tracked him. Of course, the fucking keys are all the way over there. Just hold on, hold on. Right. 
I need something to... Okay, Daniel. I see some keys, but I can't reach them. <sighs> Maybe I can get them if I can pry this pipe off the wall. Can you find some kind of tool out there? I don't know where one is. I, I think I saw a big file thing in the workshop with all those bear sculptures. I know you can find it. Okay. I'll try. This is it! You rule, Daniel! Come on, let's do this. Yes! Good job, bro. Daniel, do you see anybody? No, I... I don't see anybody. Uh, come on, you mother... Yes! Score! Did you do it? Here, here. Come on. happen okay we need to cut this off fast how about these dude you rock did that asshole see you no way I'm invisible yeah you are okay now we gotta get my stuff and go What happened? What? What did you do? I, I don't know. I don't know what happened. It's okay. You're safe now. Move it. Let's go. Now. Come on! Come on! Wait! Shit! Where are we going? Sean! Watch out! Over there! L let's go! I don't know! out in the woods. Get in, you too. Hurry up before he catches us.
That is crazy. And I thought I was having a shitty day. I knew that guy was sketchy. Did he mess with you too? They started too earlier, but I bought too much stuff just to piss him off. Welcome to Redneck Land. This ain't Seattle no more. We only lived in one place my whole life. Kinda lame, but... Well, you're pretty young. You have time. That's what's great about traveling. It gives you perspective. Sometimes maybe too much. Well, don't let it phase you, little dude. You're going to meet some amazing people on the road, too. <coughs> What's under the blanket? Come on, I'm not stupid. <sighs> Daniel. What? We saved her. <laughs> We're heroes. Yeah, guess we are. <laughs> so, what should her name be? Hey, your dog, your choice. Oh, cool. Let's see. Um, mm, how about uh, mushroom? She totally looks like a mushroom. Yeah, that's pretty cool. <laughs> Not much of a girl's name, though. Who cares? I'm sure she loves it. So do I. <laughs> All right. Mushroom it is, then. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. Thanks, big brother. See, Mushroom, you got the best name ever now. <laughs> mushroom. <laughs> nice. Yeah, I feel like I just witnessed history. You're on your way to becoming official road warriors, my dudes. <laughs> Sounds like you've been on the road for a long time. Long, boring story short. I come from a family with money. But, no soul. I took off after school, and never looked back. Now I write stories for zines and websites, do podcasts, protests, try to make some positive change. Yeah, whatever. Wow. So you're like all political. Everything is political, Sean. So, how do you make money? <laughs> Spoken like a real American. <laughs> Just curious. Now that we're urban nomads, too, if you have any tips. I sell shit. Like a good capitalist. Stories when I can. eBay when I can't. My biggest expense is gas and food, so it's easy. Hmm. Hey, no matter what, I just try not to get cynical. Otherwise, I'd be like my family. End of the day, we have to watch out for each other, right? Yeah, you did watch out for us. Thank you. Seriously. <laughs> Looks like your brother crashed hard. Oh, good. He always goes right to sleep in cars. Yeah. And feel free to do the same. I won't take it personally. What about you? You okay to drive? Oh, yeah. This is my favorite time to drive. Traveling by night is kind of mysterious.
Man, look at that. Oregon is like the edge of the world. Hmm. Hey, listen. I know what happened with you guys in Seattle. Do you want to talk about it? I'm a good listener. It's your call, no pressure. I... I don't even know what happened. It was so fast. It was all my fault. Daniel wanted to play slaw me, and of course I told him to get lost, and our asshole neighbor was picking on him, and I freaked out. So Dad came out to help. Somebody called the cops, and they killed my dad in front of me. It's all my fucking fault. All I had to do was play with Daniel, and Dad would still be alive. I fucked up my whole family, and now we're alone. Hey, it's gonna be all right. Take a deep breath. Listen, it's not your fault. You don't have control over all this stuff. You can't blame yourself for everything that happens in this world. You're gonna be okay, Sean. How? My life feels like... like that town down there. Wiped out. Destroyed. Empty. Like I have nothing. What is sure is, that's the past. But you can't look back now. You've got each other. And you have to move forward. Why? You may not see it, but what you and your brother have is the most important thing. He needs you. And you need him. I can tell he doesn't know what happened. Sean, at some point, you're gonna have to tell him. I know. I just have to find the right time. Take it from me. The sooner you can address it, the better. Yeah. I'm gonna do it next chance I get. It's just... It's not gonna be easy. So then, what's your plan? Where are you going? Cut question. I was thinking... Get out of the country? Fuck it. Go down to Mexico, you know? <laughs> Damn. I thought I was the long-haul traveler. <sighs> Maybe this is crazy, but... Should we just keep going? Till we get to Mexico? If you think that's the right thing to do, yes. This is exactly what you're supposed to be doing. You have family there? <sighs> Maybe. We don't even have family in the U.S. Except for grandparents we don't see anymore. What about your mom? No, no way. She's... out of the picture. But Dad, he always talked about this plot of land he owns in this little coast town, Puerto Lobos. That's a pretty cool name. So it's gotta be great. Okay. So you've still got a long ways to go. We've shot the shit long enough. Time to hit the road. Listen, 
I'll drop you by a motel in a couple of hours. You guys could use some time to yourselves. <laughs> okay, Mushroom, you can chase me. Then, Sean. <laughs> um, no. Come, see if you can catch me. Ow! Glad to see him act like a kid again. How will I tell him? Too bad sandcastles never last. We're so lucky Brody helped us. If it wasn't for him, we... Guess I could play a little with these two. Hey! 
Let's play fetch with the pup. Really? Yes. Let me do a test throw first. Cool? Well, okay. But I'm next. Okay, puppy. Go wide. Come on, Mushroom. Get it. Go, Mushroom. <laughs> Good doggy. I think we need a frisbee. Now she wants me to throw the stick. <sighs> okay, here. <laughs> Watch how fast she'll get the stick. <laughs> you go for it. Just don't throw it too far. I won't. I swear. I mean, I promise. Come on, mushroom. Come on. Look, it's a stick. Fetch. Looks like these two are getting along. It's good to see him like that. Well, I got you that room. Seriously? I... It's only a room. No big deal. Look, I had tough times when I started out. And some strangers saved my life. Thank you. Now's my turn to help someone. It's right there, room 10. On the second floor. Listen... I don't want to freak you out, okay, but you have to be twice as careful now. I know it's easier said than done, but you should get rid of that phone. Really? You can always get a burner later. Trust me. And Sean, talk to Daniel. He deserves Chloe, to... You're not leaving? Are you? Yes, I am, but not until Santa Brody gives you a goodbye gift. Ta-da! I, I mean, ho, ho, ho. And don't you dare argue about it. I'll leave it right here if you do. Okay, you win. Thanks, Brody. Feels good. Here. Looks like it's yours now. As always. <laughs> Hold on. I didn't forget you. I've had it since my first road trip. And it's always kept me safe. Now it's yours. Cool. Um, do you think it's okay if she wears it? Like, our official guard dog? <laughs> sure. It's your bandana now. Okay. Time for me to hit the road again. Hey, don't look so sad. You can contact me on my blog, A Tribe Called West. So, you better keep me posted when you can, okay? We will. Thanks again, Brody. <laughs> ah, bro hug. Wish you could stay with us. Me too, kid. <sighs> Sorry, I'll probably think of a better goodbye when I'm on the road, but until then, take care, my dudes. I'm gonna miss him. Me too. Okay. Time to hit the sack. Don't worry, Mushroom. I got you. <laughs>